but let's finish off the sublimage first and then I'll backtrack on another cleanser. So this is the one I got this because I wanted to try out these products and I wanted to save some money. So I got this one, the CC La Creme La Creme U, the eye cream, and believe it or not, I got this at Costco and I saved uh, I think like forty dollars or six sixty forty to sixty dollars let me go back I'm trying to find the details of this um, it's a half an ounce 15 grams where it is um the regular price is 240 crazy huh so this is ultimate regeneration eye cream this rich velvety cream provides complete anti-aging care for the eye, delicate eye contour. So then there's a bunch of claims and basically it has a vanilla plantifolia plant from the rare and potent molecules of the vanilla plantifolia plant. Chanel creates the, oh my goodness, I can't pronounce it, ephemeris of plantifolia. At the heart of Sublimage, La Creme U is this breakthrough through ingredient along with enriched plant Tifolia PFA addresses the signs of aging by aging by helping to enhance firmness, uniformity of skin tone, hydration, and radiance. So I can't say that I would repurchase this. Um, this is not an empties video, but I'm kind of giving you my opinion on it um, because I am liking the clay de po because I got a little jar sample of the clay de po eye cream I'm liking that one a lot better this one feels a lot heavier the clay de po has more slip to it so when you open it up there's this thing right I'm trying to get the plastic thing anyway there's this plastic thing but apparently it's stuck to my lid it's it sets on there and then it comes with a little spatula to scoop it out so it pretty much looks like that it doesn't look too pretty so let me just put a little bit on my hand so you can see you know it's just like that I mean it's still it's a nice eye cream but um getting milia if you put too much eye cream you get this milia on there so I have to be really careful because I was putting some eye creams you can put all around but I just put a really small amount under there and they say you're supposed to put this size of a grain of rice did I talk about this I feel like I've talked about this maybe I did talk about this in another video um, I can't remember maybe it was on eye cream so that's that's it for the sublimage line that I have but I wanted to go back real quick to um, cleansers but this is actually an exfoliator mm, masks and exfoliators it's not a, under cleansers this is considered an exfoliator and this one is $45 Maximum Radiate Exfoliating Gel. It's two and a half ounces or 75 milliliters. And what does it looks like a white gel with pink beads? And I don't know if they're um, plastic, but they feel like really smooth, rounded beads. I don't really like them. To me, they don't exfoliate that well so this product is an energizing refreshing exfoliator in a gel cream texture that awakens the complexion to reveal skin's natural radiance pearl powder provides ultra gentle exfoliation while order orange blossom concentrate helps revitalize and illuminate the complexion it says use in morning and evening one to three times a week apply a to damp, thoroughly cleanse face and neck, avoid the eye area, rinse with water. So I wouldn't repurchase this one, 
what I don't, I don't, I'm not crazy about the beads or whatever is in here. To me, it's not exfoliating enough. The base of the product, the gel of the product is nice and it has a nice fresh fragrance. I'll let you see what it looks like here. So I wouldn't, I'm just trying to use this up. I wouldn't repurchase it. I feel like it's not um, focusing. I don't know if you can see that. It doesn't look like it's focusing. So there's a lot of those little beads in there. So the other thing is this, you have to really wash this off your face. That's one of the things I don't like. It's, it, because if you don't wash it off thoroughly, like I didn't, then you have the little beads on your face. And it was a no-go for me. So I tried that and I won't buy that again. So there's that. So that completes the washing, the washing, the, I don't know, skincare that you rinse off part. So the other product that I want to mention is the Lift Flash and okay so I got this off of is it Poshmark? Yeah Poshmark. So I don't recommend th this was fine this was in a sealed package. I don't recommend buying beauty products off of Poshmark because sometimes people are selling the testers and I have no idea how they get the testers. So let's go to the lift. So I just wanted to try this. Um, I'm just not going to like waste my time or money with products like this again that claim to, li to lift things. Anyway, so this is Firming Anti-Wrinkle Serum. The regular price, and I got this for a lot less, Regular price is a hundred dollars, and this is quite small, um, half an ounce or fifteen milliliters. I'm trying. I don't remember how much I got this for. Maybe like seventy. I, you know, I did get a discount, and so if you're going to buy something from Prosmark, I recommend getting a. A sealed unopened package but I actually don't recommend buying these you know makeup products from T Poshmark you don't know what you're gonna get so this is an ultra weight ultra light fast absorbing serum that helps to provide immediate anti-fatigue benefits for a firmer and smoother look the complexion is visibly rested refreshed and full of youth so maybe it has a slight tightening effect. It has the key ingredients, signature 3.5 DA, which I don't know what that is, essential vitamins B3, C, and E, help to provide immediate anti-fatigue benefits for firmer and smoother look. And then some type of Chanel exclusive form of dive clinic acid. Use daily as needed to, for an intense lip, lift to enhance the result. Layer under the lift serum and proceed with your usual skincare. So that was my experiment that I wanted to try so I won't be buying the Le lift products anymore. So there was that. And I do have a video on the LeBlanc line, which I'm going to insert a link somewhere to this video on here that I think I go into more detail for this. So you can click on that for a more detailed talk on these products. But so basically, you have the essence, the serum, and the cream. So out of the three products, I re recommend the Essence. The Essence is very watery, and it does leave like a moisturizing, let me see, a moisturizing film. 
see, you can't even, I, you can't. <laughs> Very hard to see. It does leave, it's like locks in moisture. It leaves this moisturizing film on your skin. Um, and the LeBlanc line, again, it has its own signature to each of the lines. And it, so this is a nice um, essence. And, oh, I just saw our, your own LeBlanc Rosy Glow Light Drops. It looks so pretty. They make it look so tempting. Let's go back to LeBlanc. I want to be a little bit briefer because I pointed you to that other video. So this is $68. And so basically the, this whole line enhances the appearance of healthy, pure light. It's to like it's not a brightening I mean it, it you appear lighter brighter not it's not skin lightening you apply this after you cleanse your face with your fingertips or a cotton pad and then you follow it with the serum and the cream so I recommend that one and then, let's see, maybe I'm just doing too many products in one video. Let me know, do you like a bunch of products in one video, or do you think I should just narrow it down and not do as many products? So let's, I'm trying to find the LeBlanc again. So this is the serum, and this serum is... Uh, whoa, that's expensive. I, I had like a credit or something. This one is a hundred ninety-five dollars, and so like the both the serum and the moisturizer, I won't buy again because the thing I don't like about the moisturizer is there's no SPF in it. I mean it's an okay moisturizer, and this. I can't tell you when a product is working or not, really. So this one is a 3-in-1 serum that revitalizes, brightens, and restores the complexion. And this apply before moisturizer, you know, after the essence. And I'm trying to find out the size of this. 50 milliliters or 1.7 ounces. So there's that. Okay, I'm going to show it to you. This is a clear, uh, I just dropped it. It's, this serum is a clear serum. It's running down my hand. And I dropped some. Again, it smells, has that LeBlanc scent, which smells nice and fresh. It's not overpowering. So, I won't be buying that one again, but you may like these products. You may like that one. This one is $130 and 50 grams, 1.7 flow ounces. So this is a comforting moisturizer that delivers intense, long-lasting hydration and reduces appearance of dark, dark spots. So, maybe this is saying that it lightens. With use, the complexion appears soft, even plumps and plump and luminous. So I have a lot of spots. It would take a long time for this to get my spots. Oh, but yeah, it says three in one. It doesn't say that on the website. Underneath it says three in one healthy light creator face. The names are, they get so long and complicated, so I wouldn't purchase this, um, but you want to see what it looks like. Again, it smells really nice. It smells nice. I'll put a little dab, which you, I think it came with a spatula. You, the sanitary way is to use a spatula, not stick your finger in that. So, it's a basic... 
um, nice moisturizer. But I didn't like the fact that it doesn't have SPF. I like the SPF to be included because then I have to add another step. So there's that one. Now I'm going to wipe my hands off again. So I have, oh, I have three more, three more items because, um, and I talked about this one before. I ran out of the blue serum eye. So this is the blue serum. And I probably won't be repurchasing this again because I just wanted to try various products. This is Face Revitalizing Serum. It's a starting from 100. There's two sizes. Okay, wait. Sorry, my computer is slow. So, uh, one flow ounce or 30 milliliters. It's not showing up. So the one flow ounce is 110 and then the 1.7 is 150. So this is a lightweight nourishing serum that helps keep skin looking younger, firmer, healthier. After four weeks of use, skin appears smoother with a 35 reduction in the appearance of wrinkles. Skin appears both 26% firmer and 37% more even. So, yeah, I'm not going to get hung up on all the statistics about products anymore. So the key ingredient, inspired by regions where people live longer, the blue zones. Chanel Research sourced three longevity ingredients from the diets of the blue zone popula populations for the first time in breakthrough skincare. So, but I'm just stuck on the word diets. This is not something you eat. So I don't see how that applies to your skin, putting it on your skin. So it says green coffee from Costa Rica, Bosana olives from Sardinia, Lids. I can't pronounce that. Lentisks from Greece. Um, naturally occurring oleonic acid helps reinforce skin's natural restorative abilities. So the olives from Sardinia have essential fatty acids and higher level protect skin fortifying polyphenols to help protect the skin. The coffee, ooh, that sounds good. Heighten, I'd rather drink my coffee than put it on my skin. Heighten antioxidant properties help shield the complexion. And then there's clinical evaluation, then there's their little studies, which... Anyway, apply blue serum morning and evening to cleanse skin prior to your existing serum or stand, or as a stand, use it as a standalone serum. So here we go. I'm going to show you. So it's it's a little white translucent serum. And this blue serum has another, this line that has a different scent. I think it has a scent. It smells like it has scent. It's, it's different. And so actually this feels quite nice. I guess I would recommend it more than the Sublimage Le Fluid but I like this one it's just really expensive but I would recommend this one over this one mainly I like the way this feels but this is pricey it's nice but this is quite pricey so this is what I meant by when I get off on a tangent I like them, but I'm not going to repurchase them because I like. I want to try something else. They're they're good products, but I'm not saying none of the products I'm saying I say wow it takes away my wrinkles or whatever. I'm not. I don't think I can ever say that. I don't think I feel comfortable saying that. So we're gonna go to the Hydra Beauty, and I have this in another video, I believe too. The Hydra Beauty. Camilla um, water cream 
The Heatra Beauty line is nice too. Actually, I have two products from that. So, so since I brought this up, we'll do this one first. Heatra Beauty Camilla Water Cream Illuminating Hydrating Fluid. This is $55 for 30 milliliters or one ounce. And this has like a radiance. It says illuminating hydrating fluid. This is, I believe this is a, yes, this one does say it's a moisturizer. Lightweight fluid texture. This refreshing face moisturizer is drenched in camellia water to an intensely hydrate skin. The illuminating formula leaves complexion prep for makeup with a glowing even, even tone and print, uh, appearance. Um, so this one says to apply it after the Micro Beauty Serum, or you could apply it after whatever serum you're going to use. So I'll just let you see this one. So this one is more opaque looking um, than the last one I showed you. It's thicker, feels really nice. And the Hydra Beauty has its own scent, which is light and refreshing. Not overpowering, smells good. So I haven't actually haven't used this one in a while and I think I'm going to use it again. It feels really nice. So I recommend this one. I recommend this one. And it's more relatively the price range is relative it's relatively a better price compared to the other products I showed you. Um, and oh, I think this is the last product, which I talked about this one before. This is in the Hydra Beauty line. Hydra Beauty Lotion Hydration Protection Actually, Hydration Protection Radiant, very moist. I talked about this one before. So this one, you would use this one after. This is like a toner. You. I thought it was a moisturizer, but it's it's more like a toner. You would use this after you cleanse, and then you would use this, and then you could use your serums, or serum, and then you would use this or whatever moisturizer you would choose to use. So Hydra Beauty. So the Hydra Beauty serums, and I talked about that before, the micro serums, I didn't like them. I, I don't remember if I tried the Micro Essence, but I didn't really like the the Beauty Serum. This, oh, okay, here I found, finally found it. This is $45 and it's 150 milliliters or five, five ounces. So, this is basically the same size um, as the sublimage toner I was just showing you. And that one was 150 so that this one is a better deal. So this is a lotion that rebalances, hydrates, and protects. Delicately scented, the comforting Hydra Beauty Lotion Very Moist Gel transforms into an exquisite water-like texture that leaves the skin feeling soft, comfortable, and radiant. Apply morning and evening with fingers or a cotton pad to clean, dry skin. Follow with Hydra Beauty Micro Serum. If you like this video, please click the like button. Please hit the subscribe button to subscribe to my channel and be sure and hit the bell button to be reminded of new videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.